Oh snap! We got new angles. Oh, what about the light? Oh, oh, do I look sick? Bro, I look like fucking. I look like a hardcore dog. Oh. Can you see through the thing? Whoa! Just vibing. <laughs> I could be shooting anywhere now. The package I've been waiting for. Oh baby, look at that. Gloves. Look at that brush. It's a helmet, this is pretty lit. Pretty snazzy. Now you put my big ass head. The big 120. The Viper 120. This is what we're waiting for. Check out the fit, bro. Mm, bit of light reading, trying to figure out what everything is. You're not speeding me. Look, 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 look. <gasps> Hello. Look. Okay, oh, keep it on, keep it on. Can you see through the thing? Whoa! What is that? <laughs> I can see my toes. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? Hold on, turn this way. Okay. Ready? This is my phone. <laughs> it's what are you doing? Oh, you're what are you doing? What are you doing? Lift it up. What are you doing? I was just doing this. How does that work? That's all I'm doing, turning it on. <laughs> Do it again. <laughs> Why does it do that? You know what this does, right? It's a welding helmet. So it gets rid of sparks. Yes, so when you're welding, it's really bright. But, well, but how come it does that? This is an automatic, automatically darkening helmet. So, mm -hmm. as, so when something bright comes up, it darkens. You can't then, see anything, right? you can't see what you're doing. You're no, but it's really bright. So, if you adjust this, right? Oh my god, oh my god, it keeps flashing. Oh my god. Now, can you see a bit more now? Yeah. Press now, I'll put it back on oh again. And then it's like I'm blinking, but I'm not. And you can adjust it to full dark. And now it's off. It's Pretty like I'm blinking, but I'm not blinking. Yeah. Cool, eh? That's crazy, lad. Okay, we are ready to rumble. Spool is set up. It's an absolute scorcher. I was planning to do some welding today, but um, I think it's just way too hot. Just like these chilies. Probably gonna just bend some of this metal to shape. The welder is well and truly ready to go. I haven't tested it out yet, hopefully it works. But um, yeah, I'm gonna just try bending this metal to shape in the shade because uh, it's really hot, dude. Like, 28, 30 degrees, so it's a real scorcher. I found this piece of timber that I use for the Accord air system, so we're gonna get a bit of RuneScape construction skill. So, we're gonna use this timber against the metal, like that. Then we're going to kind of bend the sheet to get it in shape, so let's see how it goes. Police helicopter. Whoa. It's pretty intense. Feels like I'm in some sort of simulation. Look at that shit, man. Helicopter patrolling above to see if we're all at home. I don't know, man. This shit's gonna get a bit crazy. Meanwhile, we're just working on our projects. Oh, fuck. Oh, it's looking pretty good, actually. Yeah, right. Something like that. This is 
you some serious day job, guys. Maybe League, League. No, League of Legends. The enemy has been slain. <laughs> oh shit, not that. I'm distracting you, woman. I was trying to get your serious face where you got like a double chin going on. <laughs> 6.44 on a Sunday, about to get some weight training in, pull-ups, chin-ups, tricep dips, let's get it. Alright, quick lifting session's done. Three, four sets of each. And now we're going to suss up the courts. See you can shoot a couple hoops and then uh, start the day. Ooh, b-ball session done. <sighs> Time to take a shower. We've got a package and this one is going to be an upgrade to the camera setup. Nothing crazy. But it's like something I've been trying to buy for a very long time. And uh, I just needed a new battery for the G7X. I think I might do a video for you guys showing you the different gear that I use and how you can start vlogging as well. Um, but I just needed a new a new battery for the Canon G7. Um, you can get like replica batteries on eBay for like 20 bucks. The OEM ones cost about 70. But the thing about the, the replica ones is that when you open them up, every time you start the camera, the camera says that it's a fake battery and you have to do some button dance and shit. Like I, I turn my camera on and off so many times when I'm shooting, so I can't have that. So, we're gonna go genuine. And, while I was there, I sussed out tripods. So I've got a tripod, as well. Wow, check it out. We've got the official Canon NB13L battery, so they'll come in handy when I'm shooting. And, what I'm very excited for is this tripod. So I went with the Manfrotto compact tripod. It's got this nice head that allows you to um, do some smooth panning and whatnot. Um, and it has it goes up to 1.5 meters in height as well. So the, the tripod that I'm using right now is like a desktop tripod. So as you can see, it's like a bit of a weird angle. Ideally, I would like this to be like a bit higher so I can be speaking like eye level, but instead I'm kind of like dominating you dogs. Uh -huh. So, uh, this will hopefully be compact enough to fit. I mean, look how small it is. And it goes up to 1.5 meters tall as well. But this will hopefully be small enough to, uh, compact enough to put on my desk. And when I'm out working on the whips, I can have a big, tall ass tripod, like, you know, in the engine bay, um, getting better angles overall. So, could have just got like a cheap $50 one, um, but this one was, wasn't too bad. Um, it was 80 bucks, hey, 88 bucks, yeah. But I finessed it, right? Like I went online and I typed in the part code and this is my experience that I get from working in electrical wholesale. I typed in the part code and I looked up like six different suppliers to see which one had the best price and the best shipping. I'm not trying to say that, like, you know, you should be stingy or anything, but you should just be smart and just find the supplier with the best value. Dude, look at that. That's actually so compact. That's wild. Anyway, open this up. 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 This even comes in a nice, decent looking case, bro. That's litty. Whoa. Hell yeah, look at that. Dog. That's lit. I'm liking this. I'm liking this a lot. Boom. Boom. Oh, cool. Whoa. Okay, let me just, let me uh, change this track one. Nice, man. Okay, cool. We got a bit of a high angle thing going. I can see eye to eye. <laughs> mm, I like it. It's pretty good. It's pretty high though. I'm going to raise my chair. Yes, sir. So. Let's 
going on. <laughs> See how high it goes, bro. Yo, this is a game changer. I can just be, you know, just, uh, you know, just, uh, just vibing out. <laughs> I could be shooting anywhere now, whenever I want. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just dunking. Oh. There's no other thing I can always Come in, come in! Say what's up, say hi! This is... No, I have a friend on my face. She got a friend. Look at my tripod! Wow, that's... that's it's pretty sick, nice. I was just telling her like... I can just be it's chilling. Like... Yeah, there's nothing in between. Oh. And like, you got this mad panning feature as well, you can go like... Whoa. Whoa. It's sick. I, I just did one of How these. How much ones. is this? 88 bucks. Whoa! 80, but, 90 bucks for a bloody tripod. You think it's a lot? Yes. I thought it was pretty good. That's so expensive. Yeah, but I other, mean, like, look at it. No, yeah. but the other places were like, dude, this tripod's for like three, four hundred bucks. This is 80 bucks and nothing. Oh. But to be fair, other um, brands online were selling it for like 130, 140. So I got a good price for it. Okay. Oh, snap. We got new angles. Oh, I want to lay. Oh, oh, dude, that looks sick. Bro, I look like fucking, I look like a hardcore dog. Oh. Yeah, sick. Look at these angles, man. And this Canon battery is full JDM. Look at this writing, man. Is that Chinese? No, it's Jap. I think it's Japanese. It's full JDM. So, new battery. New tripod, new angles. This channel's going places, man. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. We're about to go crazy. And uh, we're about to drop some merch as well. Welcome on a few little designs. Took some of your feedback from the previous videos and comments, you know. T shirts and hoodies and hats and that. Most likely t shirts though, and hoodies first. Hats down the track. But, um, yeah, slow and steady, man. Just investing a couple of dollars in that. I like this angle. This is pretty cool. Look at that. All from a tripod. Obviously, this tripod isn't as... Um, this is what I used pre pre previously a lot. Because it's very mobile. You can just do that, carry it around. And then if you want to spread the legs, you can just eat it up like that. This one is actually called a KB. Um, and I think it was from JB, shout out to Kate, got this for me, so that was mad. Um, but if there's a man photo version of a desktop, it'll be sick, because they've got this detachable um, mount, so even for me to take this off, like normally you have to unscrew it completely, but all I have to do to take the camera off, is go boom, clip, oh, and it comes off, just like that. And if I want to put it back on, boom, clip, back on the tripod. That's insane. Normally you have to like do spinnies and shit. And the little piece that they're using is this little bit underneath. It's a little screw on attachment that screws onto the bottom of the camera. And then, boom, you slap it on, clip, attach. Wow, that's wild. That's wild. That's wild. So we're about to do something. <laughs> we're about to sign off. What are we signing off? Uh, Tinder. What does Tinder sign mean? Off a contract for Our a home design. Future home, so. This is like real adult stuff right now. Like I'm not ready for this. It's pretty, uh, it's a lot of information. It's a, it's a lot of information to take in, but we're just doing it one step at a time, slowly. So we're just going to sign off the initial deposit, followed by another deposit, followed by more deposits, and then bank approval and so on. So, yeah, exciting times. It's scary, Bob. What's the date today? We don't know what we're doing. 14th of September 2021. Yes. Do you know, is this time next year? It's 5.39 p.m. We're about yes. to sign it off. Yeah. Before? Progress update. Huh? Pess is hungry. No, oh! You pulled up your <laughs> <laughs>
Winners. But let's go. Is it sturdy? Whoa. It is. Is it moving? Yes. Probably not. Are the bottoms um, tight enough? Yeah, I'm really fucking with this angle, eh? Thank you for making it all the way to the end of the video. It's been quite rough the past couple weekends. Last weekend being really hot and the weekend before that being rained out. So for two weeks we haven't been able to step out and work on the Sylvia. So this weekend, so I'm shooting this on the Friday and I'm uploading this tonight. But this weekend, um, we're going to be where? I always refer to me as we, but it's actually I. I, I, will be grinding off some paint off the side and finally starting to weld on the Sylvia. So wish me luck. In the next video you guys are going to see me having metal plates welded on the rusted area, which is super exciting. So as usual, um, leave a comment down below guys. I'd love to hear what you guys think. Um, last video you guys went crazy, which was mad. I really love to give you guys that value. So probably expand on that. I might do a video where I talk about what I've done and how, what sort of numbers. I know everyone's interested in numbers that I've experienced. So once again, really appreciate you guys watching the end of the video. Take care and uh, have a great week.